I had to uh, take the throttle out of the car because I had to fix something. So I figured at the time, I, or, uh, since I headed out, I'd uh, go over it a little bit more on how it all works. Um, again, I have four potentiometers. Uh, one, one, two, three, four. And these are for the four wheels. So I'm basically controlling each motor individually. Um, this plate right here is, can slide and the accelerator pedal is connected to this plate. And this bottom plate is fixed. So as you step on the accelerator, it goes down and you can see all four of the potentiometers have their uh, angle changed. And these are uh, 85 degree um, Hall effect potentiometers. <clears throat> Um, the connection between the movable plate and the potentiometers is via servos. These are RC servos, which I will then control with a microcontroller. Um, the reason why I had to uh, take this out of the car was because um, one of the motors was running uh, at zero throttle. So basically the throttle wasn't um, zeroing. And one of the effect of this type of potentiometer is, is that even at zero throw, it has about 100, and, or I'm sorry, 700 ohms of resistance. So what I did was I inserted little micro switches here and inside this uh, shrink wrap right here is a 22 ohm resistor. And what I've done is I put it in parallel when the throttle's at zero. So in essence, what I get is throttle goes to zero, Micro switch switches on, 22 ohm resistor goes across, the uh, leads to the controller, and the controller sees 22 ohms, and the motor shuts off. So that is my uh, water, throttle quadrant right there. Um, uses a, a six inch drawer slide to keep the movement uh, in one plane, and um, I thought that was pretty clever. <laughs>